All right. Now we can even finish down here. Well, almost finish down here. Because again, I still don't have Wario. Where? Where could they be hiding my good boy? Like seriously, where could they be hiding my good boy? I am, I am confused. Uh, what was this star? Chest in the current, okay. Um, which one is which? Which is the start? You, cause I've already, oh, nope. I already lost my position, all right. Then you're the start, right? By the clam. One get. Then you? Yes. Where's my next chest? Hiding around the corner here? No. What? Where's this chest? Seriously. Seriously, seriously. Where's this last chest? Because there's, there's three around the island, unless they moved it. Or unless they only put three this time. They just got rid of an entire chest. That's, that's fine, right? That's no problem. It's just these three. Yeah, they, they removed an entire chest, which is weird, right? Like, doing the lap was not a problem. Maybe it was too much trial and error, they figured, but I don't know, it seemed fine. Huh. Nice. Nice! It's the nice number. Nice! You call it out every time you see it. We are not going to get to 420 stars in this. Oh, oh no. Oh, red coins. Is this the worst level in Mario 64? Yes, I would say so. Um, instead of pole jumping, let's instead ring. Have rings not been made stupid this time? They're a little bit closer. They're easier to swim through. Easy peasy lemon school. Easy. Don't flush me. Thank you very much. Um, but the problem with this level is that like it's two complete separate zones. It is almost all entirely underwater. It has one of the most annoying red coin stars in it just because of the way that the poles like work. It is seven. That was seven to do that? Well, I guess they put six as like that Wario one there that we see. Uh, where is there? That's what I'm looking for. Fish do not eat me. We are not playing Mario 3 Rando. I do not need that in my life. Um, and yeah, like this whole intermediary area is entirely loading zone concerns just because of the way Mario 64 works, but it's 30 seconds, 40 seconds, 50 seconds of just completely wasted time. No enemies, no items, nothing different. It's just do the P trap or the U bend or whatever you want to call it, and you're good. You're you're good. Like I friggin' hate it. Yeah. So Bowser's sub is now gone, which is what allows us to be able to do these, right? Yeah. I'm sorry, buddy, but I do not want to talk to you. Do not press go. Oh, and it's removed our bullet bill launcher. Um. Do you make my life easier? Probably. Well now, this... This is a turn of events. Huh. Let's see about cheesing this, shall we? has to be a way. There has to be a better way. Build a better star. Crap, crap, crap. We'll go around this way then. Okay. 
Guys, I am allergic to these red coins. I'm telling you, I'm sneezing up a storm. Which future me is gonna have to cut out. Grumble, grumble, grumble. But that I no longer have to press my stupid button for because of the way that I'm doing recording these days. Oh my god. So sneezy. Oh, and I already got this. I already got this coin. Okay. Um, maybe with the new way to fly in this level, I don't mind it. I don't mind it so much. This still feels kind of annoyingly slow. Will it let me get over here? It will. Like, we can do that. And then it's just that last one. Ah, maybe bringing Mario here was not the worst idea that I've ever had. Considering the fact that I'm wanting to play this game mode. So yeah, I'm playing the, the, the DS game. <laughs> like, theoretically, you could be doing most of these stars with any character. But I'm still playing it the way that I want to play Mario 64 forever and always, which is with Mario. It just, it feels better, even though there are slight control differences between these versions. So, I'm kind of not taking advantage of the fact that there are four playable characters. Don't hit that star that is ominously floating there, which would absolutely destroy my run. Oh, no, 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 let me out. Yeah, that's definitely an option that I have had is that I could be playing as any of my unlocked characters. Like, I could run around this game as Luigi, but I just think it would feel weird and different and not in a way that I would enjoy. It's... So... <sighs> wow, that texture is off. It is... It is not aligned properly. I've noticed. Hold on a second. Well, let's see if blowing my nose solved that problem. Y'all don't need to hear that. But yeah, um, you ever been, are you, like, how do, how do I des describe this? Through the jet stream, through the jet stream, I can't get this star, cause I need multiple power-ups. I can't do these stars right now. Exit course. How do I explain the situation? So. I am a creature of habit, and I like to just kind of stick with the one or two items on a menu that I know are good. And going to new restaurants is like, unless I'm going there with someone else who's dragging... Did they fix this? Yes, they did. Oh, that's the worst. They fixed the clip that I wanted. Oh, hello, rabbit. So unless I am going to a restaurant with someone who is like, oh, you have to order X, Y, Z from this restaurant. And it's it's so good. This is, this is what you want to be getting. Where'd that rabbit go? Rabbit go upstairs? Yes, the rabbit went upstairs. Okay, rabbit. Damn. Then, then, like, I'm just always going to order the same thing from a restaurant. And after I go to that restaurant with that person, I will just order the thing that they recommended from now on. Because I know, oh, that's the good thing to order. And so, like, this is like going to a new restaurant or going to a restaurant that I'm very familiar with. And they're like, we got a bunch of new dishes. And I'm like, thanks, but I'm just going to stick with the stuff that I know. You know? You know. You know, you know. You... What did you say? Hold on. Was this just a hundred coin star? Uh, special stars appear when you collect 100 coins in each of the 15 stages. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 15 stages, A. Eh? Is that how many there were in the original? Uh, yes, I think. You have a star for me, right? In the room with the mirrors, look carefully for anything that's not reflected in the mirror. Right, so that's just telling me how to, how to get into Snowman's Land. Snowman's Land. Snowman's Land. Ah, 
Tasty, tasty. Now, what I need to do, thinking of uh, Wario Land 4, is like get up a Wario Land 4 uh, scroll. Uh, do I want to do Snowman's Land? I kind of want to do Snowman's Land. Ah! You! You bastard! You! Ah! What do I want to Okay, well. No, what? What? But that's a Wario painting. Oh, maybe I need to go in there as Luigi. Ah, and also they put a bunny there so that you do the same trick as in shifting sand lands with Mips, which is why Mips is down there, I would have to assume from a game design standpoint, of run to catch Mips and then go through the wall. Fucking Christ, come on. Can you... There we go, thank you. Yeah, I don't mind. I do not mind. There we go. A gorgeous orb. I don't know why I'm collecting these guys. Like, I just don't get it. Because <laughs> I'm never going to go to the minigames. I guess to have them unlocked as a save file in case I ever want to. I don't know. Snowman's big head. Okay. So, uh, why am I not immediately going and unlocking Wario? Because I already don't want to. Hello. Oh, this is a bring Yoshi here level now. Okay. Woo! Well, you have a bucket on your head. I don't know if I've ever recognized that you had a bucket on it. Oh, and you're tinier. Whoa. Absolutely knocked me the fuck off. Oh, and there are some... There's a gated off area with Goombas with hats and fire. and That's just the bring other characters here section. I don't know if I noticed that you guys ever had uh, buckets on your head. Much like in uh, Mario or Paper Mario. Fucking Christ. Come on. Come on, bastard. There you are. I got you. I'm not doing your stars in order. I know these stars. I know these stars like the back of my hand. Uh, why was my controller doing that? Man, I really should bring up like my controller view so you can see like the representation of the N64 about like where my buttons are and it just like spazzing out. But I don't know if that would play nice with this analog controller setup that's already doing janky things. And where would I stick it? Would I stick it in there on that nice scrawl of, or scroll, I should say, scrawl. Why did I say that? The, the scroll that's going on that I've spent so much time doing? No, no, I don't think so. Yeah. Uh, I've completely lost my train of thought, but I was saying something about wanting to do, set up a Wario Land 4 scroll, like as he's riding through the desert, and just have that as, as something that I can flip in when needed. Although, Game Boy games are not set up to be widescreen, so I could either export them at a funky, at a funky, uh, like resolution, which YouTube does automatically crop, and I actually really like the way it looks without the blank space. Or I could just put that scroll in the background for whenever I do get around to LPing that game. If I ever get around to LPing that game. Not something that I'm particularly familiar with. Again, it's the Wario Land 3 is the one that I grew up with and am the most familiar with and absolutely adore. And then Wario... Super Mario Land 3, less so... Uh, Wario Land 2, basically not at all, which is a crying shame. Uh, don't, don't fucking... Ugh. That penguin, I swear to God. Again, this just feels like proto-tedium that would be later replicated in Banjo-Kazooie. I always want to say Banjo-Tooie, but no, it's Banjo-Kazooie. Banjo-Tooie, believe it or not, is the sequel. That's how that works. Anyways. Wario Land 4 is like a game that I played and really enjoyed, but it's also like panic attack inducing. Yoshi's Ice Sculpture, bring Yoshi here. Something that I already haven't done. I gotta go and start swapping characters around is what I'm hearing. Um, are you gonna give me a balloon? No, you're gonna be an asshole. Cool, love that. That's, love that for me. Can you not? And instead let me... Can you not? And instead let me kaboing? Thank you. 
That's all I wanted. How hard was that? Like, legitimately, how hard was that? And a free Shabaka. I mean, free star. Was I missing red coins there? I think I was? I also need Luigi to be able to get the thing in the pyramid. I gotta bring- I gotta bring Luigi up here. I gotta bring Luigi, I gotta bring... Yoshi. There's a lot I gotta do. Okay, well... Buckle down and do it, right? Like, that. that's just the way it's gonna be. Um, maybe I should have done all the other levels first. Just so I could see, like, what characters I need to cycle through. Oh, yeah. Like, I could, I could mop up all the Luigi stars now that I have Luigi up there. But that's already something that I haven't done and am not going to do. I mean, I guess I could just play the other levels as Luigi, but that, as I was saying... Oh, you're green now. Are you different? What the fuck? Oh, does everyone have their own unique bunnies? Yeah, your, your run pattern is totally different as well. Oh man, is this like a explore the entire overworld with every character to get unique? Oh, that is... That, as a gimmick, sounds exhausting. Ah, see? There are flowers in this room now, so I can go through the wall. I could. That's not a painting I can go in over there. What happens if I run out the back door? Uh, I'm in that Half-Life 2 Gary's Mod room. I'm in the back rooms, guys. What the hell? Where are the boundaries of this? This is definitely Luigi's existential nightmare. <laughs> Gotta love that. Okay, Wario it is. Oh, good lord. Why is it an ice level? Well, I guess because this is in the ice. Hey, Uriah, holy shit. Oh man, do I ever not want to be doing this as Luigi? But yet, what other option do I have? Oh, and I'm gonna have to come back in here once I've unlocked Wario to be able to get whatever Wario-specific star is in here. And once I've unlocked Wario, I'm immediately going to want to turn around and grab the other thing. What is this? High wind warning, you'll be blown away unless you put on some weight. Yes, clearly. Or if you turn invisible, which is also intangible, which also is invincible. So there you go. That, good to know that's up there. Oh, and that ice water will absolutely kill you. I was going to say that ice water was not giving me damage. Yes, it was. Yes, there were ice ticks. Um. So no sense red coining. Just yet. Because again... We have determined that red coining is the gating behind which Wario and the others hide. Can I, can I please not be uh, below? That would be great. And thank you, El Hushate. Uh. So yeah, Luigi can pick up Mario's hat. Mario can pick up Luigi's hat. Well, Mario can pick up Luigi's and Wario's hat. Oh, and yeah, so I need, I need to be Luigi and have Wario's and Mario's hat unlocked to do this level. Yeah. Yeah. Clearly. 